Hey everyone, so it is currently 7.58 and I got up at 7.30 this morning and then, you know, got dressed and all the basic things. Now I've made my breakfast. Yeah. I got some avocado on these crackers. Normally I have like granola or peanut butter, but I don't have any bread right now. So we're having this and I've got coffee because it's early and I didn't fall asleep till like midnight, so I'm kind of tired. And anyway, so today you're gonna see a day in my life living in Geneva, Switzerland. So I have a class at 8, but even though it's 7.58 right now, it's okay because it doesn't actually start till 8.30. Um, so I've got to leave at quarter after 8 and go take the train there. Yeah. So I hope you enjoy my day and let's go. Also, it reminds me that you have been reading this book, Winter of the World by Ken Follett. It is such a good book. I would highly recommend it. It's about World War II, and yeah, so I'm gonna read that. Right now I'm just in front of Uni Bastion. Really pretty, even though it's not the nicest day. It's just such a beautiful building. And almost all my classes are in here, so that's pretty great. So yeah, right now I'm in front of Uni Bastion and I'm gonna go to Micro right now to do my grocery shopping. I just spent like 20 minutes looking for a printer. I went to three different printers until I found one that had paper, so that was fun. Let's go grocery shopping, yeah.
here was a little bit of a struggle. So I went and got groceries at Miko, and then it was pouring rain, so I walked back in the rain with my groceries. Wow, it's like a haul. So first, I got spinach. I'm going to freeze a bunch of that. And cucumber, peppers, bananas, got some walnuts. Here we have a tomato. Um, then here I've got some vegan meat that I wanted to try out. A can of diced tomatoes. A can of red kidney beans. Cashews. We've got some rice milk. I'm actually been really liking this rice milk here. Um, yeah, if you're in Switzerland, try with this rice milk. It actually tastes really nice with some granola, which I just got. I'm trying out like a different muesli granola type thing every time I buy it. So here I've got this seven grain one, which looks pretty good. I really like the crunchy ones. I don't have time to like make it myself right now, but I really like granola. Granola is so good. Then here we've got some cocoa powder because I want to bake more. I bought these mini tomatoes for the first time, which I haven't actually bought since I've been here. So they are really good. Then I got some chocolate, this chocolate. Look at how amazing this looks. Just, just look at that. It looks so good. I like to have a square of chocolate every day after dinner, so this one just looks so good. And I was look, I'm just so excited to try this. Next we've got some hummus. I got some paprika chips to snack on because they're so good. They're European. We don't have these in Canada and they're just, they're really good. These we don't really have in Canada. They're these really good cookies. I'm sure for any of you European people out there, you're probably like, why are you buying those? It's not like Christmas or something. But they're so good. These are so good. So we've got those. And then I bought an egg, well, eggplant, which I think I'm gonna use tonight with my dinner. Three onions, an avocado, and chickpeas, some soap for the bathroom. And finally, I got this moisturizer for my face because I need some more. Um, so I'm trying out this one. It's the Nivea Aqua Sensation. It looked kind of good. My friend recommended it to me, so I'm going to try this out as well. So kind of a reasonably expensive grocery haul. I pretty much bought everything that I need because I am really out of groceries right now. So yeah, that's how this is going. I'm going to put these away and then we'll continue with my evening. I'm going to make some dinner. I'm hungry. And it is currently 6.30. Now my fridge is so much more full. Peanut butter, my love, that you love, and also this chocolate that I want to try. Hey everyone, so I finished putting away my groceries and now it's like the first time I've sat down all day, so this is really nice. So basically this morning I had my English Linguistics Travaux Pratique at 8 a.m. So that was two hours and, you know, it was pretty good. Then I went to my English Literature lecture so that was pretty cool too we were talking about rhyme and blank verse in poetry and it was really really interesting i enjoyed it a lot i love that class so much and then after that i had lunch with my friends so you got to see them and we all went to the cafeteria and had lunch and i i just brought my curry because i don't like to buy things out too much and after that i went to the library in the bibliothèque de genève which is really really nice i went up to the second floor if you go up all the way to the top of the bibliothèque de genève it's really nice and yeah it's just like the nicest place to study so i was up there with one of my friends and then after that we went to our analysis of text travel pratique and that was pretty cool too so we just discuss a lot of the literature ideas that we happen to go over in the lecture and then we discuss them in class like more in detail and you can ask questions and go over things so that's really nice and basically this is my only all English day all my other days of the week have more but today it's pretty chill yeah I've had a really good day although I feel like I've done like 30 flights of stairs today I have walked so much and I'm also dead because I had my yoga lattes class yesterday I'm I'm just a little sore my whole body hurts because I'm been walking and moving and exercising, which is good. It's a good thing. And yeah, but my body hurts. So there's that. And otherwise I've just been working so hard on my medieval history project right now. But you know, if you're in the same state right now and you're in university and you feel like you're behind or really if you're at any time in school, like we all feel behind. Like you're always trying to get ahead and trying to do as much as you can, but a lot of the times you still feel like you're behind. You still always have things to do that you feel like should have been done earlier. So don't stress about it if you're in that state right now. I am too. It's a lot of work, 
The IB program prepares you well for university, but my program is definitely a lot of work. It's very enjoyable and I love it, but yeah, I'm doing a lot of work. So yeah, there's that. And I went to the uni party on the weekend. The university had a party in this big, um, well, it's just a university building actually, Uni du Four, and they transformed it into a party and it was really fun and I went with my friends, so I'm really happy I did that. So here we've got my dinner. I've got some crackers, some tomatoes, some hummus, some boiled spinach, which I would like to steam, but I don't have a steamer thingy yet. And then here I've got some eggplant, some fake meat, and some onions, all kind of in a curry type thing. So I'm excited to eat this. smells so good and this cookie which is so good I love these cookies so much so I'm gonna try this and I'll tell you guys what I think then I've got to read some stuff for my composition class in roles for writers so I mean I don't necessarily need all the grammar stuff but it is kind of interesting to see what the rules kind of are for things like you know semicolon usage and stuff like that so that's what I'm gonna do okay Okay, so conclusion, this chocolate is really good. If you're in Switzerland, try out this chocolate that I showed earlier. Really good. So I just finished reading the first half of this article for my medieval history class about women in professions during the Middle Ages, so pretty interesting. Um, and I did my composition homework, so that's good. And now I'm going to FaceTime with my dad, so that'll be cool. And then after that I'm going to go to bed, so yeah, and clean my room a little bit. So I guess I'll say goodbye to you guys now. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really hope that you enjoyed it and you got something interesting out of it. I really just love it here. So that was my day. It wasn't the nicest weather today, but I got to go to some interesting classes and I got quite a bit of work done. So I'm pretty happy with that. And yeah, that's my day. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.